Hey everyone, Taylor with KC Highlights here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to replace your stock fog lights with our Gravity LED G4 fog lights on your Jeep Wrangler JL. Now specifically today, I'm going to be installing our replacement fog lights onto this 2018 JL Rubicon with the standard front bumper. However, we do also have kits available for the JL Sport standard bumpers and the JL Rubicon and Sahara upgraded steel bumpers. The process is pretty easy. It's just a couple bolts that has to be removed. So with that, let's go ahead and get started on the install. The first step to removing the stock fog lights is to remove the plastic shroud on the back of the front bumper. As you can see, these are held on with six different panel retainer clips. You can see five of them in this shot here, and the final one is actually located underneath the bottom of the bumper. So to remove these, just use a panel remover tool or just a regular flathead screwdriver to pry them outward so that way you can reuse them later on when you go to reinstall. While you're underneath the Jeep, there's some more plastic panel retainer clips and a couple of screws that need to be removed to be able to pull off the stock plastic splash guard from underneath. Once that's off, you can then fully remove the plastic shrouds on the back of the bumper that hide the fog lights. Next, with that out of the way, then you can go ahead and remove the four screws that are holding the factory fog lights in, and then while you're at it, just go ahead and unplug the factory wiring harness from the back of the fog light as well. Then put the KC G4 fog light into position and reinstall the four factory screws and attach the wiring harness. In order to properly aim your fog lights, I would only work on one side at a time. Now this is something that I didn't film, so I'm just gonna have to describe it. So once you have one of the KC's installed, turn on the fog lights and then aim your new beam cutoff line to be at the exact same height as the beam cutoff line from the factory fog light on the opposite side. You can do this by parking about 15 to 20 feet away from a wall and then turning the adjustment screw on the back of the G4 fog light to get it aimed perfectly. Once you have the new fog light aimed, then just repeat the same process on the other side to remove the other factory fog light and then reinstall the KC G4 fog light. Then go ahead and aim that one using the exact same method that I just described. Finally, when both lights are installed and aimed, then you can reinstall the plastic shroud on the back of the front bumper, along with the plastic splash guard underneath the Jeep. As you can see, it was a pretty easy process to get these installed. It only took about 30 to 45 minutes to install our KC Gravity G4 LED fog lights onto this Jeep JL here. Now, before you guys go, I'd love for you guys to comment below and let us know what other kinds of videos you'd like to see from us going into the future. And while you're at it, please subscribe to our channel to make sure you don't miss any content from us. Thanks for watching.